Hi, second graders. This week, we have been working with uh, syllables, and I want to remind you that words can have more than one syllable, and we call these syllables word parts. And we're going to, I'm gonna say a couple words, and I want you to try to count the syllables with me as I say the words. So we have carpet, carpet, carpet. There's two syllables there. Let's try another one. If you, when you say the word garbage, try and count how many syllables you hear. Garbage, garbage, two syllables. What about the word tunnel, tunnel, tunnel? Again, two syllables. Do you see a pattern here yet? Let's try the word member, member, two syllables. And the word pencil, pencil, pencil. Excellent, so all of those words had two syllables. And we're gonna take a look, I have this start, I've started five words here. And each part here is a syllable and we're gonna try and make a complete word by adding a second syllable to these words, okay? Um, do you think we can see the screen okay? Or let's, we're gonna try and move it a little bit closer so you can see, excellent, I think that works. Now we're gonna work with the glare there a little bit. All right, thank you. So here we have nap. And what would we add to make a word here? Would we add kin, rick, sick, or nip? Well, at lunch I'd like to use a napkin when I'm eating. So we're gonna add K-I-N. So we're gonna have nap, kin, napkin. And we would divide napkin into two syllables between the P and the K. I'm gonna show you a trick. Remember the other day when we did vowel, consonant, consonant, vowel? See, you have the two consonants there? That's why we can divide it into two syllables. Next, we have fab. So what would go here? Rick, sick, or nip? I hope you said Rick because we're gonna have fabric. Again, we have our vowel, consonant, consonant, vowel. So fabric is divided into two parts here. Let's take a look at the next set. We have class. And what would we add here to make a word? Rick, sick, or nip? We would add the sick, so we have classic. And then when we are dividing classic into syllables, we can find what we did earlier. We have our vowel, consonant, consonant, vowel. Classic is divided into two syllables between our two S's. So now we have pick, what would it be? Pick Rick, sick, or nip? Pick, ooh, or how about, I forgot. I should have this up here, because we're actually gonna make the word pick Nick. So I'm gonna add Nick down here. See, it's okay, sometimes teachers make mistakes too. We just gotta roll with it. So we have pick Nick. The first thing we're going to do Let's find our vowels. We have our A, sorry, I, and another I. Divide into, find our two consonants. Pick, Nick would be divided right there between the C and the N. Next we have cat. So what's gonna make a word here? Cat Rick, cat sick, cat Nick, or cat nip? It's gonna be cat nip. And we have our first syllable here, cat, nip. Divide right between the double consonants there. So that's just more practice with dividing words into syllables or word parts.